So, the full Happy Me philosophy, just to remind you, idea one. You have a billion dollar brain. You don't know what you're capable of. There's things that you could do. I always say, like I could, I could throw this glass at you, and you'd do that, and you'd just catch it, or you'd fend it off, or you'd. But you don't know. You don't go. Oh well. What I need to do is keep beating my heart, keep, uh, keep uh, breathing. Watch it. Watch my eyes. Move my eyes over here. Move this elbow. Restrict this muscle. Contract that one. Whichever way around. Do that. Uh, you have no idea how to do all that. But you have a billion dollar brain that, that can work it out. Look, how the hell does it do that? You've got a billion dollar brain. Set huge goals and go for it. Idea two, what you think about you become. So if you're constantly thinking negativity, then you become negative. If you're thinking positive, uh, what you want to happen. So idea one, we've set massive goals. And idea two, we think about them all the time. Well, what do I need to do? Well, this is the goal. I've got a billion dollar brain. I don't know how I'm going to get there. But we're going to get there. Idea two thinks about it all the time. Idea three is create, don't compete. So you, you, you create your uh, you, whatever you need to do, whatever you need to do to get to your goal. You create. You just keep creating. Don't compete with anybody else. I don't care that there's a, there's a, there's there's a probably a million people do better YouTube videos than me. But I create the Happy Me philosophy. Because I've got a goal to reach people, to, to get them going, to motivate them, to, to be happier, to live a happier life. An idea four is trust the feel. So if you think, uh, I want to be a YouTuber making loads of money, and you think, well, I'll just what I'll do is I'll rip all these, uh, there's a few channels that just rip people off. They just steal the videos and put them on their channel, and all of a sudden they're making money. But that will feel crap. That won't feel good. And if it does to you, then fair enough, go for it. But for me... I wouldn't chop somebody else's video. I wouldn't nick somebody else's video. I don't steal people's stuff. I don't charge overcharge for things. You know, I, I do what I feel is right. Just do right. The t-shirt I usually wear, just do right, yeah? So that's the four ideas. Then the fifth the fifth one is four, four rules for great self-esteem. First one is forgive everybody. Forgive them. You don't do it for them. You do it for yourself. You know, there's no point holding grudges. There's no point thinking about revenge. There's no point thinking how people have pissed you off or let you down or done whatever. Just forgive them. They've got their own crap they're dealing with. But you do it for yourself, for your own soul. And then two is forgive yourself. So even more for you. You have to forgive yourself for all them stupid things you've done. I forgive myself for eating cheese sandwiches last night and having to, you know exercise and work it out today I don't feel great I forgive myself like I'm gonna get better and I'm gonna get on to whatever's next right uh, rule three is just reset to being the best you so you go all right I wasn't on it yesterday I wasn't on it 10 minutes ago I can reset at any second I can reset and be great again and be me just be the best me what do I need to do next go into the goal reset to the best you to get to that goal and four Go at your pace, play at your pace, do your, do it in your time, don't do it in my time, don't smash videos out or 100 mile an hour stuff that I do, or um, I play golf 100 mile an hour, but do it, play in your pace, you don't, you're not competing right, this is you creating not competing, so do it in your time, do what you need to do to get to your goal, concentrate on what you want to do, create don't compete, trust the feel, Forgive them, forgive yourself, be the best you, but go at your pace. Go at the speed you need to go to get to your goal.